guys it is monday morning we have got such a busy day ahead of us but i just thought i would jump on and say hello first thing we've got is our nails at 9am so we're going from a chocolate brain i'm thinking over a neutral one last time before christmas or there is this one color i want but i want to see how like it's got like a shimmer in and i don't know whether to just wait until christmas for that and have like more of a magical nail i don't know um we've got a few missing um but yeah thought i would just jump on say good morning and um, me and my mum have literally got to leave right now i will just show you this tracksuit because i think it's really cool you'll like it morning baby right i've got on this new boohoo tracksuit it's really cool it's like a charcoal-y like blue almost um sweatshirt um jogger and then they're just like nice baggy joggers and i've just put my uggs on Um, i get it in a size medium but there is a boohoo haul going live on the channel this week and it will have this in so it will most likely already be up by the time this vlog is making the light of day so yeah um nails let's go see you later oh my god i can't even use this anymore because it says 21 <laughs> oh these are the nails you need to see them in better light but i got like a friend with a like pearlescent iridescent e tip they're really cute because they're like sort of but they've got a tip and also it stresses me out when it's a bright tip in case the tip's bad do you find yeah like I, I, they do look nice these are they're subtle. yeah they're subtle and the thing is when it's a white tip on your hand like no matter how good your nail tech is it's one smudge and sends me you know what I mean? And you're looking at them and you think, oh. So, we've gone for these. I'll show you properly when we're in a bit more light, but it's freezing cold. It says, in the car, it said it was six degrees. It's tipping it down. Literally, all you want to do is put your pyjamas on and watch... Christmas movies. Yeah, Christmas movies. You know what Christmas film we should watch in the hotel tomorrow? Because oh. I... No, I... Re no. The Lindsay Lohan new one. Have you seen it advertised on Netflix? Yeah. The, it's Lindsay Lohan. Yeah. It's like a, you know, like one of the ones you would watch. Yeah. It's one of the shitty Christmas films that you'd find on like twenty four seven Christmas. But I really want to watch it, so we should watch that. Okay. Um, We're have munchies. Yeah. So <laughs> I've got to get ready. And um, I've got to sort out what I'm taking to London, and then I'm going to see me because we've got to get some. Um, we've got to get two product shots of the glosses but the weather's so bad it's gonna have to be an inside job so we're just shooting something very something weird. weird something really crazy I guys good evening it's a few hours later um had a very productive afternoon with mia we did lots of uglo stuff because she's restocking and she's got like new products and stuff so it's really exciting um i didn't really give you guys a close-up of the nails but it's like a french tip but it's got like an iridescent but they're so cute um anyway me and mum are off to london tomorrow in the morning we're literally getting the train at like half seven so i need to pack we're only going for two days so i don't need anything crazy but like i need to decide what i'm wearing tomorrow we're going to the theater so i need an outfit for that and then i need an outfit for the next day like all my toiletries you know makeup hair stuff um, I've got to do some work while I'm there, like edit videos, so I need to make sure all my YouTube stuff's packed. And yeah, so that's going to be our plans for this evening. And then I want to derma plan my face and dye my eyebrows. Oliver is on his Xbox, so he's occupied. And we've got a busy night. I've just posted all the parcels off for um, like the giveaways I did in, not last week's vlog, the week before. I've just posted them all off. So I'm really excited for the girls who like, I just randomly chose to receive their bits. And yeah. 
that is the vibe. It's still raining. It's literally been raining since, I don't know, 8 o'clock this morning, which is really fun. But yeah, um, I've wrote a list of what I need. So we've just got a suitcase out. Me and Mum are just going to share like a medium sized one so that we're not lugging around two. And that is the vibe. So I'm going to get on with it. Cue some cute time lapses. And let's get on with it. I is about to begin we have got for derma planning your essentials a good oily serum i always use this one from sand and sky it's called australian emu apple dreamy glow drops and then i just use this what's going on and then i just use these i get i do use a new one every time i don't know whether you can yeah. reuse them but can they hear me i think so um, I'm not sure if you can reuse them, but I get them from TK Maxx oh, it's, it's, and it's, it's like 12 in a pack for like £5. It's really good. So it literally lasts you a yeah. year. And then to dye my brows, I always use this Isla. I like in dark brown, but I've only got, I could only get black when I've needed a restock. So those are my essentials. And then I might just give my brows a quick tweeze, but they're not awful to be fair. And I feel like they've gone quite thin, so I don't. I don't really want to touch them. Um, but yeah, let's do this because we are so hairy. six for train it's about um in about an hour but obviously we've got to get there so um well i think it's past half six to be fair i think it might be like quarter seven no makeup i'm gonna do my makeup on the train because i thought it's quite a long train so we've got to get two so we've got to go from like Cannock to birmingham birmingham to london so i thought i can do my makeup on one of the trains but i thought i'd just show you what i've got on excuse that you can see my bra but i'm gonna have a coat on so I thought, what's the point? Primark, PLT, Adenola, um, Boohoo socks, Axe guys, and I'm just going to put this coat on. I've got my hot water bottle. I'm just going to fill up because I think it will keep me warm on the train. I feel like the train's going to be really cold this morning because it's freezing. And then I've just got like my laptop, my makeup and stuff in my tote bag. It's actually got everything in. It has six pockets, guys. I'm only using two. Um, just gotta look at my phone in, a snack. If you can hear the dog, it's because she's going crazy downstairs. Can't stop her. Um, yeah, but I just check in. This will actually be like a bit of a. There'll be a bit of a jump now because I'm gonna I think I'm gonna vlog London separately, depending on content. Hopefully, I get enough for it to be like a night out. I don't know, like thirty minute, um, like trip to London vlog like festive shopping so we're gonna do a lot of shopping um like winter wonderland sort of vibe so if that is the case then this vlog will be picked up on Thursday when I get home so love you all um hope you're enjoying the vlog anyway and yeah see you with lots of stories about London hello I'm back I am back in Cannock London was so much fun i'm just oh get myself ready right disclaimer before this clip gets into fruition it's tan scrub off day but i've got to film today because i've got such a busy day tomorrow and then i'm literally on jury duty from monday for i mean maybe a week maybe two like i don't know they don't really tell you um so i've got a film today but i've also got a tan fresh tonight so i've had to scrub my tan off 
So I've literally pulled my foundation down my neck just so you know, keeping it real. Um but I'm gonna do a scrape back bun because I haven't done a scrape back bun for quite a while. Um I've been doing like a ponytail which is cute, but I just feel like doing a bun today. So I thought I'd catch up with you guys while I do it. But yeah, London was so good. We had so much fun. Um I won't ruin well the See, I'm confused. So, tonight I'm going to have a gift guide go live. One sec, I haven't got my um, mousse. This is the mousse I always use, by the way. I think it's from B&M. Um, so, yeah. Tonight I'm going to have a gift guide go live. And then, obviously, I've got the London vlog. And then, obviously, this weekly vlog. Um... So I'm thinking gift guide tonight. I'm so confused, honestly, guys, what to do. And then I know you lot always really love the weekly vlog on a Sunday, but I'm thinking like the London vlog, like by next Tuesday, like it's a bit gone. Do you know what I mean? So I'm thinking London vlog on Sunday and then this on tuesday and then we'll get back into the usual routine but i mean depending on jury duty i actually don't know how like the wheat vlog will be like i don't know when i'll finish or like i don't really know i mean we'll cross that bridge next week but um yeah london was so good this morning i've literally had a bath i'm just catching up on mia's vlog and things and i've got so many parcels i came back to so many so we're gonna open those in a minute but i'll open them with you guys in a minute um tomorrow me and mia are gonna do some new glow stuff possibly get some content and like get her ready for the restock oh gosh i need to tidy my room i need to unpack i need to edit i need to film a video so we're very busy today um, catching up i've got so many emails that like i've been opening but not responding to so i feel like i can't do too many things at once i thought like i can't be thinking about like collabs when i'm in london like i couldn't you know and you just check your emails and i was like fuck i don't know what's going on i always feel like a ballerina when i have my hair in a bun i've got to move some my dressing gown this dressing gown is from ikea and it is so cute it's like a waffle material right guys we've got quite a few um i got this off amazon because me and mia watch this um lady i say lady girl i don't know she's a mom she's only she's actually only our age but me and mia watch this girl from um america called mckenna walker and we love her like if you love big fat weekly vlogs go and watch her she's so cool um and she does like hygiene routines and basically she was doing like an oral one she does like feminine ones and everything and within that i think it was the latest one she was using a tongue scraper and i thought wow i love that because i always brush my tongue like obviously when i brush my teeth but she said these like do a complete different job so it's like <laughs> so i got that literally off amazon it was like three pounds i thought that's so good sorry you were dying and um, this is a like tampon brand because um so they reached out they're called riley and they do like all like organic toxin free um, and chemical free pads and tampons so i got 12 regular sanitary pads i do i am more of a tampon girl but in recent months um I've like gone to a pad sometimes, especially at night time. I don't really like to sleep in tampons. So pads are good for like more like evening or like just if I'm getting really bad cramps, sometimes I don't want like to be messing with a tampon. I'll try them next month. Um, but I mean, it's bed a lot. Obviously no toxins, you guys know that that is my vibe. Um, I also got a box from my protein. Um, Need something to rip it open with strawberry cream oh that looks so tasty so they they protein will just like gift randomly like every week sort of thing so this is the slender blend protein and it's strawberry and cream flavor that actually sounds really nice ollie loves a strawberry um, protein shake and then this is their salted caramel flavor porridge and you know what their porridge is really nice and um, i've tried their chocolate one and like getting into um, like winter i do like to 
go for more of like a warm breakfast like sort of go away from like fruit and yogurt and go for more like porridge or like egg on toast you know um, and then also some multivitamins. I think this is off a brand called Sorel. I'm sure this girl, like back in the day, um, she was like the Instagram influencer. Like I love her. I'm sure you guys have heard of the brand, like her name. Well, I don't know if her name is or whether her Instagram handle was just, but it's like Sorel. Um, it's this brand. Make sure my dress isn't on it. Sorel UK. Um, and I'm working with them on a TikTok, but I got some really cute things so the first thing i picked was this like zip up and um, this is very similar to that one like everyone is going crazy for on tiktok shop and um, it's sort of like the bow and tea stuff i have but it's like a nice thick ribbed um long sleeve i got it in this like a sort of electric blue teal because i think this color is just really cool these are the leggings they've got like the tie on which i think are so cool like i can wear this to the gym but i can just wear it for like and um, like errands running with like a pair of bugs which i think is so cute and then i also got this because it looks so snuggly oh my god it looks so wow it feels so thick i got a little like knitted um cream jumpsuit and i thought how cute is this it's like a little um it's like a this really soft material and I just thought with like a big car to go and I'll like under a trench with my Uggs or like just slippers in the house. It's going to be so cute. So that's all the PR I come home to, which is so lovely. Um, very lucky. Thank you to everyone who sent things. And yes, I am going to. So plans is I'm going to find something to wear. Oh, should I do like I need to find something to wear. Um, and then I'm going to get on filming and then I'll check in with you guys later on. It is currently 12 o'clock so I'm going to get on with it. not deliver i want just like a classic traditional like white company-esque like candle like you know when it has like all like the dried like flower not I don't know if it's flower i don't know like when it has like the dried stuff through i want something like that and um, but b&m like had cute things but not like the christmas candles were very just like red pot with a santa on and i don't really go straight to the roots i don't really so I might just pop into Asda because I know they've got similar. I'm sure I've seen something similar on TikTok. Right, they don't have like a huge home section here, but I found this. Um, I think it's six pound. It was on its own, but then there was like one similar for six pound with more like summer colours. So I'm thinking this is cute. It's very spice. Um, I'm thinking this will be cute, and then like I could even try and find like a red tray or something, or like a white tray to sit it on. I was like at my own house, like I had my own home, like I for sure would, but like because I'm just at my mum's, I'm like doing my bath bag, but there is some cute ones, but then it's like what colour do I go for? She goes. 
Good morning. Bye. Um, here are my babies. We just went on a lovely morning crisp walk with Mia and Raw. Bye. Oh gosh. Oh. Ah. That poor car. The thing Mia just drove over. That poor car. Um. But it's 9.15 and we've had a very lovely start to the day. Got up, washed my tan. Um, so much better than the last few times. I also did my makeup so I'm just ready for the day. Um, I'm just going to drop the dogs off. And then I'm going to... God, I look like the Michelin Man in this um, coat. It's from PLT. I love it so warm. Um, it's just like a hooded, big, like... It's like no facey, I would say. Um, yeah, now I'm going to take my grandma shopping. Um, and then, um, but the tan, not really. One sec, let me pull out. I use St. Marit's, sorry about the sun, um, St. Marit's and Dark, but I mixed it with this one called like Self Love by Kimberly. It's a bit of a random one, but it's really good and it dries so fast. You know one thing that I think is shocking? The amount of Christmas songs that are like just on like, not even on Heart Xmas. I haven't even, is it still on here? I did, oh here it is. No, it won't even play. Um, not even on Heart Xmas, there's so many songs just on Heart. Like this morning driving home, I had three Christmas songs on and I was like, what is going on? This is the puffer, look how like, cool it is i actually got mine somehow for 10 pound in the sale um, but it's got like a hood and let me see what size i got you cute you're muddy i got a 12 and it's perfect this is like so thick and puffy i feel like it's a real like north face sort of vibe kind of crazy oh, oh. I saw something kind of crazy I'm looking, but if you want to, we could. How about you? Hi, guys. We've got earmuffs. We're earmuff girls. Earmuff girls. <laughs> We've just come to get some like last minute tote bag um, content. It's so easy to get content. It's so easy. And you know what the best part is? I was thinking, what bag do I take? And I thought, There's it's a bag no shoot. Bag. Literally. Yeah, bag. Literally. We got a caramel macchiato. Obs. Obs. Mine's gone there. Really Water. Like there. When you stood here. Well, you look really glowy in the Really? Look. We do look like little eggs. <laughs> glowy girls. <laughs> Right, let me put this in the bin and I'll grab the water. <laughs> we had an ordeal. Guys, <laughs> we've had an ordeal. We've had to leave the abode. <laughs> we have had to vacate the premises, drive to McDonald's. So basically, we ordered a delivery at 6, 10, yeah, basically 6 o'clock. It's now quarter past 8. It literally got delivered after two hours because all like the drivers were on strike. And it was apparently, <laughs> Yeah, it was cold. Like apparently the drivers were accepting the orders and then when the food was ready, they were ditching it. Six, so it 60 key. orders. It's really bad. So we decided we're not going to eat cold food. We deserve better than that. I was panicking because I was like, I couldn't find my receipt. On like, you had to sign oh, in to deliver yeah, it. There was no receipt. Like, and we only had the paper. But he just took it right. Yeah. We said that's going in the bin. But I just yeah. was saying, what a waste of food. Oh no. And if that's happened, well, there was three other people, wasn't there? And the same. Yeah, and that's if just there was, while we've been there. And if there's sixty orders oh, gone no. in the bin at minimum, <gasps> that's not including that's us. Awful. It's such a waste. Look, apparently the drivers have gone on strike, so let us know if that's happened by you. Yeah, I reckon that's why Uber was off. Do you reckon? They're currently unavailable, yeah. isn't it? No Uber drivers. No. Out of we got up out of delivery, didn't we? I'm not really a delivery Uber. No, I'm not. I'm I don't always think I go Uber after this. <laughs> I always to go honest, Uber. Me too, always Uber. Occasionally just eat if it's a random. Yeah, if it's not um, heavily deserved. Yes. <laughs> yes. If it's a local. Yeah. But a Uber local. Eats is. And Uber Eats is the easiest to log in. Oh, no. I find you just in, aren't you? It's so convenient. It's advanced. It's so boring. But then delivery is the only one that does waggers. Does it? Yeah, Uber Eats does it. You can't right, get it see, off. when I, I've never ordered a waggers to the house, right. I've only ever ordered directly from Wagamama's. Yeah, yeah, we're all going. Right. 
so I don't know that. It's like if you go on delivery, like to the delivery option, it takes you straight to right. delivery room, not Uber Eats. Oh, yeah, I did not know that. So anyway, we're yeah, gonna we've eat got our it. food. We've I'm got excited. our food, we're happy. <laughs> got a McCrispy. Good vibes only And we've got the cheesy. <gasps> wow! Wow! And oh, I've got so some more. Oh, this makes me feel so Christmassy when the Christmas we need lights to go on, start. We need to go on a night drive. drive. Yeah, yeah. Because you must know some good spots. I do. I we, do. I know the local area. I, I know the good. I reckon as soon as it hits December, I reckon the second oh, week of yeah. December we should go. Yeah, for sure. See all the fun lights. That'll be so much Let's fun. We've got a hot chocolate. Yeah, you can get joy fruit. Oh my goodness. Yeah, let's do that. Bye. Bye. Wait, go for the ball. Oh, bye. Bye. <laughs> I've just um, dropped Ollie off to his van. Um, he went to the pub last night to watch the match. So he left his van. Um, but I've just dropped him off. And I got off really late actually. I think it's because like when we went to London I got up at five and I didn't go to sleep till really late that night. So like I barely slept. Like I probably had like three hours sleep. And you know when you need to catch up. So Ollie got in last night about and I hadn't really fully gone to sleep until he came in like you just know when you know they're not home so like I was watching YouTube like dozing a bit but like I wasn't fully asleep and then I didn't wake up till like nearly 11 this morning like Ollie said right get me off like I don't want to like waste the day like luckily he's not even hung over it but he's like I don't want to waste the day like lying in bed he's like get get me off and then he woke up before me he's like why are you awake so late I, I, asleep so late I was like I don't know. I thought it was going to be like nine o'clock. It was literally like almost eleven. Um, so it's now ten to two. Um, I showered, did my makeup, um, put some gloss on, put my hair back. This is like it's, it's annoying because my hair is so lovely here. Like it's so. Me and me were talking yesterday. So like when you start growing your hair and like. I feel like at the start, like when you're not doing like weekly hair masks and like really like putting product on it and stuff, but your hair always goes really dry on the ends. I haven't washed my hair since last Thursday. It's now Saturday, so like nearly 10 days. Basically, I feel like when you're actually looking after your hair, like they don't go dry, like you split and even though I haven't had it cut for a few months, like your ends don't go dry even when you haven't washed it. Um, so literally my hair feels like it's literally been washed like a day ago, which is just super um, slicked back from all the products I've had in it. Um, but yeah, we've got hot Xmas on, it's a good time. I feel a little bit Christmassy, I can't lie. Front door Hi guys, I'm just at Ollie's and because we used to live here there's so much stuff that like I left I didn't um like take with me because obviously my room isn't as big and things um and like just stuff I don't use but I just found this huge oh, I think it's a bit away. I just found this like huge thing of like old makeup and it's like 2015 era like 2017 like when Kylie Cosmetics and things came out it's so cute and I just posted a TikTok but so much stuff in here and like look at this I'll show you guys my outfit it's literally Boohoo Zip Up and then my Adonoda set really comfy but I love this um this here is ah, this here Oh, those are like Apple Watch things. So much stuff here. I dread the day having to like really sort through this. So this is basically a box me and Ollie made when we first got together. And like we've always put things in here. 
So this is when we were living at my dad's in 2020. We bought our first Christmas tree. Like little friendship bracelets. Um, some Polaroids from Rome. Look, little Polaroids. Like our first like holiday. It's so cute. This is I think in Rome too. Another Polaroid man so long. Who our two year anniversary when we went to TGI's. I don't think we did anything for our first year anniversary because we were so young. I don't think we really had money. Like this is from Mallorca when they had loads of frozen yogurt. Yes, that's what I'm doing. And then we're gonna go and grab some food. Guys, this is my favourite Christmas song. Are you gonna try to sing? I have got up this morning and headed to Aldi to get ahead of the week. I thought, perfect, let's get it done. I haven't really got any plans this morning. Ollie's just headed to the gym for a big session ahead of um, Sunday roast at my nanny's. So I thought, perfect, let's take yourself to Aldi. <laughs> let's get the adulting done for the day so we can just be the cute granddaughter at Sunday lunch. Um, literally look like a huge marshmallow in this, but I'm I feel like it's just going to be my everyday like run around coat because it's just so warm, so comfy, so warm. What could what more could we want? Um, but I've got a shop in this. We just like brainstormed some ideas, but it's so much busier on a Sunday. Normally I'm here on a Monday morning, um, and obviously like most people are at work, so it's really quiet. But I had to drive around this car park three times to try and get a space because it's so busy. Like I'm actually a bit worried to go in. But we've done a little shopping list of just things we thought that we might like. So I'm thinking the creamy garlic chicken dish because it's a winner. Sausage and mash, Thai curry and then Ollie wants like a shepherd's pie. Um, I'm going to see if they do lamb mince. I'm not really sure if they do. But um, yeah, I just thought I'd pop on and say hello. We never get to spend Sundays together, which is so cute. Um, and because this is going up later than Sunday, we can spend the day together, which is nice. So... Um, I've I haven't got any bags because I forgot them. So um, literally all I need is my phone. Um, let's go. I think I might go to see Kaima as well. Of course I forgot my pain coin in. Can someone please get me a trolley coin for Christmas? Mum, if you're watching, it would really help me out. Guys, it says December. Just spotted these. Hey, I've not tried these before, but I'm tempted to get maybe the strawberry and kiwi and see if they're nice. So, like 20 grams of protein. It says drinking yogurt. I think I might leave the vanilla because I think I get a bit sick of it and get strawberry and kiwi. Oh no, dropped on the floor. Dear customers, we are closing till.
my god, the bows in TK Maxx are so good. I haven't got much time, which is annoying. I feel like I need to come and spend like an hour. Look how cute this is. The little deers, I mean, you can put like a little tea light in there. I mean, can we appreciate the vibes? Looks so cute. I've just like this. I don't really like the tassels. I'm wondering if I could, oh, it's 20 pound. Is that a lot for a cushion? I can say this is cute, but I'd probably maybe cut the tassels off. I don't know if they look a bit old, but 20 pounds a bit pricey for a cushion. I was just thinking to make the room, my room a bit Christmas, I thought. Hello guys, I thought we would just have a chat to end the vlog off. Let me just put, get something to rest you on. You okay there so look what i got from aldi it's like the um look it's like the vanilla honey bath thing it's um a dupe oh sorry if you can hear the dog she's just having a moment um is it laura geller i think it is the box was a bit battered but i thought i'm just gonna get it so you get like the little swell this is it if you want to look for it they've had it in my aldi for a while um, but that's the box that you're looking for. It's vanilla honey, golden bath nectar. And then it's such a good Christmas present because it just looks so bougie. I can't have a bath really until midweek because of the tan, but I'll definitely use it. Oh, you're about to die. How annoying. You just put some coconut oil and a hair mask through my hair. Wanted to do full coconut oil, but um, it wasn't like spreading through my hair properly. I don't know whether it's better to do like coconut oil on wet hair. I don't know. Wow, look at that. So you basically put this in and sprinkle it. Um, it smells like literal. Oh, wow. Like uh, that smells like an iced caramel mac with honey mixed in. That's so nice. Cannot wait to have a bath. Um, so I thought we would end this vlog with some gift ideas for boys. So I'm thinking... Um, boyfriends, brothers, dads, uncles, stepdads, husbands, like anyone like that. I've wrote some gifts down. I was going to do like a full guide. If you want to know like a full guide, there's two on my channel from, I think one from 2020 and one from 2021, obviously. I thought it would be nice to just include them on the back of here. So I don't know why I'm looking on my phone because I've literally wrote them down. Um, this is like a good 15 sort of idea gift guide. So get your phones out ladies because i'm about to help you with your christmas ideas so clothing wise these are two brands that i would say represent and the blank tracksuits it's like called the blank range are so cool a little bit pricey but really good just like basic tracksuits my boyfriend loves them and then i put a cortez tracksuit if you can get on a cortez drop it's a little bit confusing but if you what i do is follow the guy on it's like a really cool streetwear brand if you follow the guy on twitter and you put him on no post notifications basically he releases stock with a password and then you just enter the password onto the website and then it lets you on and it's like first come first serve so it's really cool like not everyone wears the pieces i mean it is very popular but um if you can get on try it i do it um i got a ollie a really nice tracksuit for his birthday um then I put down shoes wise, I think Nike Sakai's are a very good um, idea. Also, um, the Off-White Out of Office is a really cool. Dunks, Jordans, but I really like Sakai's on a boy. I think they're like a really perfect mix between streetwear and a little bit smarter. Um, then I just put down like the basics, socks, brands I love. Nike, obviously, Gymshot do the best socks. And if your boyfriend works on site or like he's like a tradesman, like I'm sure a lot of boys are, um, JCB socks. They're really thick. They're on my Christmas list to get my brother and my boyfriend because they both really like them. Then I put down headphones, AirPods, um, if they're like a gym goer or whatever. Tattoo vape chat, very good. We got this, my brother, for his eight. Guys, you died, but I'm so close to the end of the vlog. And my other um, battery's in the car, so sorry about the iphone quality but i mean it is the new iphone so i'd like to think it's not awful um i definitely look contrasted but we're just going to move through so i'm going to go through very quickly the rest of this i'll tell you what you could get with the socks you get like waterproof ones yeah literally for like mm. sight and stuff or biking perfect mm. literally and <coughs> 
there she goes how inconsiderate i know and then for the gym if they're into the gym i said like gym shark stuff or like protein slash vitamins because yeah. i hate boarding protein i love just receiving things like supplements. that as presents supplements yeah. yeah then after shave i put savage a prada after shave and hugo boss they're good brands um sounds good and then gaming stuff xbox controller 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 and um, gaming chair have you got any ideas monitor maybe monitor could have a monitor we got piccolo monitor maybe uh well, those cool controllers. UK wireless headset, maybe. Yeah, true. You don't want the wire or the um. That... Well, anything with a wireless it just charger. Which is yeah, I was gonna say the wireless. You know, like how your battery. The battery packs. Yeah, the battery pack. So those are our ideas. Tess has come to ruin it, so let's end it. Say so, thanks for watching the weekly vlog. Thanks for watching the weekly vlog. Thank you guys for watching. Um, I hope those little gift ideas gave you some like quick little easy gift ideas for just like any sort of um, generic boy. Um, I hope those give you some ideas. I'll link some of those ideas down below so you guys can shop them. But love you all so much. Thank you for watching and being here and supporting me. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll catch you on Thursday with a brand new video. Wish me luck on jewellery.